Peterson's Capture Recapture. Peterson's Capture Recapture method is a way of estimating the population size. Some animals are caught, they are then marked. The marked animals are released to randomly integrate with the population. Some of the animals are then recaptured. The proportion of marked animals in the recaptured sample is the same as the proportion of marked animals in the total population. This allows you to make an estimate of the population size. So how do we make an estimate? When estimating a population size, there's a total unknown population of animals. Then a sample of the population is captured and marked in some way. It could be with dye or with a tag or with something else. We can count the number of animals that are captured. So let's say there are 30 animals captured in the sample and they are all marked. They are then released to randomly mix with the rest of the population. Then after enough time to let them reintegrate, Another sample of animals from the same population is captured, but this time some are marked and some are not. If there are 40 recaptured animals in total and 10 are marked and 30 are unmarked, then the proportion of marked animals is a quarter or 25%. We assume that the proportion of marked animals in the recaptured sample is the same as the proportion of marked animals in the total population. So we assume that one quarter of the total population has been marked. This means that this original group of 30 marked animals is one quarter of the total population. So we can use this to estimate that the total population of all the animals is 120. Here's an example question. Becky is estimating the number of rats in a warehouse. She captures and marks 84 rats and releases them. The next day she recaptures 20 rats. Three rats have markings on them. Estimate the total population of rats in the warehouse. In the recaptured sample, three out of 20 rats have been marked. So that means that three out of 20 of all the rats in the warehouse are marked. There were 84 rats originally marked. So 84 is 3 20ths of the total population. So if this is our total population, this amount is 3 twentieths, and that is worth 84. One of these twentieths is 84 divided by 3, which is 28. To find the total amount, we must multiply 28 by 20, which is 560. So our estimate is that there are 560 rats in the warehouse. Here's another example. Becky is estimating the number of bats in a cave. She captures and marks 75 bats and releases them. The next day she recaptures 40 bats. Five bats have markings on them. Estimate the total population of bats in the cave. You might want to pause the video and give this a try. So again, look at the proportion of recaptured bats that are marked. There are five out of 40 recaptured bats that are marked. 5 out of 40 is 12.5%, which means we assume that 12.5% of the total population of bats in the cave are marked. We can also use reverse percentages to calculate the total population. 75 divided by 0.125 is 600. There are 600 bats in the cave. Well done if you got that. When using Peterson's capture recapture method, there are some assumptions we must make. The marked animals mix thoroughly with the general population between capture and recapture. The proportion of recaptured animals that are marked is the same as the proportion of marked animals in the total population. The number of animals does not change between capture and recapture, for example, through deaths or births. The markings or tags do not wear off between capture and recapture. This method can also be used on inanimate objects, like estimating beads in a jar, and not just on animals.